Hello. You there? How are you? <laughs> you alright? <laughs> oh dear. Welcome to Lee's Reviews again. And again. And again. Like and subscribe, it's free. Totally free. So there you are. New picture. I need to sort of do, sort the border out a little bit better because I mean it's all there's not a bit on there, there's a bit on not a bit on there and it's not right sort of right. <laughs> so I've got a bit of O C D so I've got to get that down and get it put it proper. I've got some green sort of fancy stuff to go around the edge, so I'll perhaps do that after this review. So yeah. <clears throat> so there you are. Yeah, gang of monkey chilling on a Monday. Miserable Monday, again. God, Mondays soon seem to come round, don't they, quick? Wow. And the next thing you know, it's the weekend. So, yeah. <clears throat> I'm at the school this weekend, though, on Saturday, so I haven't got the children, so. But I've got them next weekend. And then the next weekend, week the week after that is half term again. So, so yeah, I'll have them. I'll have them for one. I won't have them this weekend. I'll have them next weekend, and then the weekend after. I think that works out right. They break up on the yeah next Friday. They break up. Well, my my do. I don't know about your your kids or your school, but my my school where I work, they break up on next Friday, which is the fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. The 16th. Yeah, the 16th. So I'll have them next week. And then it's they break up next weekend. And I'll have them. Because I've got Thursday, Friday off next week. Week after. So I'll have them for Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So it works out alright really. So there you are. Well, I hope you're alright on a miserable Monday. It's, da it's dark. It's sort of windy. Um, excuse me. It's um, <clears throat> What's the temperature? Oh, excuse me. 11 degrees, so yeah, it's... I don't know. <clears throat> I'm just watching the whole lot of the darts. The Masters yesterday. Quite good, actually. Stephen Bunting. I was pleased that he won. If you're into, if you're into darts or sports. Yeah, Stephen Bunting beat um, Michael Van Gerwen, so... Yeah. Good. It was a good final, and I'm glad that he won, really, because he's, he's sort of struggled... Um, a bit because he won the world championship in the BDO, the old BDO, which is rubbish now. But he moved over to the PDC, and he's finally got his his um, title. So there you are. So fair play, Stephen Bunting. Well done, mate. And li and a fellow Liverpool supporter as well. So there you go. <laughs> there you are. All right. <clears throat> yeah, I spent a bit of money at the weekend. <laughs> um, I got the kids some bits because I got um, them air at bottle refund, so I got them. I got myself a new set of darts. Um, really nice they are. They're more sort of style. I like the long, I like the longer ones. So there you are. <laughs> longer ones and they're nice. Got a nice grip. These were twenty three pound. Again, I treat, I treat myself. You treat yourself. Winmar, and there's lot there's the Aussie, MVG and Dal Gurney, and that's the Aussie. What's his name? Simon Simon Whitlock. Jesus. Yeah. So yeah, I've had a throw, and they're really nice. They're nice darts. So yeah, twenty three grams. So there you are. So anyway, right. I'm gonna do a carbonara now. Um, this was from Lidl's. Um, <clears throat> I'm not expecting too much to be honest really I think it was 90p it's got bacon in it and it says spaghetti in the creamy cheese sauce with the cook with cooked bacon pieces I don't think it'll be that prawn carbonara that I had from Heron Food that was that was lovely that was but you never know you know 90p which give it a go yeah I love a carbonara I'll just um, 
be nosy. I've got my TikTok. I've got my black TikTok trainers, but I'll I'll review, I'll, 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 sh I'll show you them tomorrow. Okay, right. Here it is. I'm going to pour it in the bowl. You don't have to see me pouring it in the bowl. I look, I look like a numpty anyway when I do it. <laughs> yeah, carbonara. I do like it. It's got big bits of bacon in. There you are. And I'm going to chill out and relax for three hours. <laughs> late, late today and then I've got Friday off and then I'm in Saturday so but only it's only from half ten till half three so it's not so bad as you know anyway I've told you there you go it smells all right let's give it a try right Lidl spaghetti carbonara. Cheers. It's not too bad. It's not, you know, it's not. There's big bits of bacon in here, look. I'll show you bits of bacon, look. Yeah, it's not too bad. There you go, look. There's bits of bacon. There's some little herbs. <clears throat> yeah, it's not too bad, actually. I think I know what it needs, though. Me, personally. Let's get a bit of, try to get a bit of bacon. There you go, look. A bit of bacon there. Yeah, that's not bad actually. That's quite nice. Yeah. For 90p. I'm just gonna. For 90 pence, that's not bad at all. Really isn't. Hmm. Yeah, that's not too bad at all. You know, I'm not knocking that at all. That's quite nice. But. Um, I need to sort this desk out again. It's absolutely crackers. Try a bit of salt. Yeah, that's all right, that. Bit of pepper. Bit of white pepper, that is, I think, yeah. Stir it around a bit. Yeah, I had a lovely weekend with the kids. Um, picked them up. Then we went to town, that home bargains place, and went to McDonald's. Then had a couple of beers in the pub. I think you've seen the short. I was drinking a few, I had a few pots of Madri. And then we come back and chilled out. And then my brother dropped us, dropped us back um, yesterday, which was which was a bonus because normally I get the bus. But yeah, it was nice that he offered. Well, he didn't offer. I said, "Can you give us a lift back back to Davant to wherever they are, to where they." Where they are at the moment, oh, Jesus. So yeah, he dropped them back, and then I had a beer with him, um, and I come back and chilled. So yeah, it's a lovely weekend. Right. Yeah. God, that is. That's transformed it, honestly. God, yeah, that's lovely. Much better with salt and pepper. Right, nine and a half minutes, but there you go. Again, on my channel, I told you I'll have a chat. I'll chat and review things. and I might start doing different reviews instead of food. Like, like I said, I've got these darts here. And I've got my dart board, and I might start doing, you know, dart reviews. And, you know, have a lot of clothes, clothes and things like that. And lots of tip the TikTok shoes and stuff. If I can save you a bit of money, then I will. Right, made in Ireland, UK, yeah. 
ingredients. Where's the ingredients? Here it is. Right, spaghetti in a creamy cheese sauce with cooked bacon pieces. Um, water, diced cooked smoked bacon, pork, salt, um, cream, milk, cheddar cheese, soft cheese, regatto cheese, onion, um, garlic puree, salt, black pepper, parsley, ground nutmeg. Yeah, that's really nice that. I'll have another little bit more and then we'll wrap it up because I'm going to chill out and watch film now. But yeah, that's nice. I can't really... Well. Hmm. It's totally transformed it with that little bit of salt and pepper. Much, much better. But it tasted okay without it. You know... Um... For 90 pence, that's, that's all right, that is. And if you had a bit of garlic bread with it, that'd be lovely. Um, right, rating. Um, it take, I don't know whether to, whether to rate it with the salt and pepper in or what. I'll, I'll do it with it out, because I had to do that. But, I mean, yeah, for, 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 for 90p, that's brilliant. It really is. Um, it tasted okay. The bacon was nice. I could taste the herbs, the cheese, the garlic. So, yeah, that's all right, that. Um... But like I said, I had to add a little bit of salt and pepper to it. But you didn't have to. I'll give that a... 9.2, that is. It's 9.2 from Lidl. I'm sure it was 90p. I'm sure it was. Lidl, 90p. Spaghetti carbonara. Yeah, it's nice. 9.2. But like I said, I added, I added, added a tiny little bit of salt and pepper to me. So, there you are. So what, well, yeah. I'll love you and leave you now. <laughs> Late one tonight, so it's going to be a, you know, what are you going to do, eh? you got to do it sometimes, and you? unless you win the lottery. So there you are. Right, yeah, lovely, 9.2. If you like your creamy carbonara, your creamy pasta, it's worth it. And like I said, I'll, I'll put a little bit a bit more salt and pepper in it, and it was lovely. It's not, I'll eat, I'll eat that now for my lunch. 12 o'clock now, so yeah. Anyway. I love you and leave you now. Thanks for the subscribers, by the way. 495. I want to hope to get 500 by the end of the week, hopefully. Or by the end of the day or by midweek or something. But yeah, anyway, 500. That's brilliant. Um, yeah, thanks ever so much anyway. So, right. <laughs> I love you and leave you now. So anyway, if you've been out to you, my whole world, darling, yours are, yours will be. Simple as that. I'll leave you to bits, darling. We had a great weekend, didn't we? I won't see you this weekend because I'm at the school, but I'll see you next weekend and then I'll see you for four days half term. So, and I'll call you later, darlings. Okay, I love you to bits. So anyway, I hope you have a good miserable Monday. <laughs> so anyway, <laughs> oh dear. Take care, all the best. I love you all. And I'll catch you soon. Cheers.